My husband can't stop talking like a baby during intimacy. We all go through phases and pick up annoying habits, and sometimes we just need our loved ones to gently tell us if we picked up a particularly egregious habit. Sometime in the last year, my husband has picked up a habit where he talks like a baby. At first it was funny, but passed into embarrassing, cringeworthy behavior quickly. Examples, doggo, pupper, woofer slash subwoofer, pibble, hootie boy, peepo, burb, meow meow, sammy, samishes, sammy whammy, chicky nuggies, chicky tendies, adding a toddler-esque to words, and the ones that really get gross are childish euphemisms for private parts or intimacy. I cannot emphasize this enough, it is not endearing or sexy to have my husband talk about my honkers and his winner and weenie and wee-wee, who is and bajingos, nostalgia for scrubs be damned. We have not had intimacy for six months because he cannot stop talking about my honkers and it makes me sick. Just before the virus hit, we were out at a restaurant with some friends, he actually ordered a chicky Sammy-like, said that exact phrase. Chicky. Sammy. Look, it's totally fine that he ordered the chicken sandwich. That's not the issue. Our friends noticed the baby talk, because he insisted on continuing the joke and even started talking with this god-awful toddler. Lilt? Accent? After that, I just couldn't stomach the idea of going out with him to adult places. I'd go out to the brewery with friends, but god forbid he join me and say me want another beer. Or something. I don't know where it came from. I don't know why he's doing this. I finally hit my limit when we were grocery shopping and everything seemed normal and fine until he gasped like a kid, ran to the ice cream section and jumped up and down yelling ice cream ice cream. I want chocolate. I was mortified. People were staring at him and me. He kept going and kept saying can we get popsicles? And I just said either talk. To me like an adult or I'm leaving. He started saying oh you must be fun at parties and lighten up, will you? And stuff like that. I just said F it, and left the store, leaving him to walk home, like a mile, it was fine, because I couldn't even look at him. Since then, things have been very tense, and he keeps telling me that he wants an apology for embarrassing him by leaving him in the store. I told him that people don't get to demand apologies, if someone wants to apologize, it's up to them, and I am absolutely not going to apologize for saving myself the embarrassment of a 35-year-old man with a mortgage and retirement account asking for chocolate ice cream. He got his mom involved, no joke. She keeps telling me it's just a phase and that he's probably bored and I should be happy this is his midlife crisis, rather than him ifing 19 year olds at the local bar. I'm going crazy. Do I really just need to let my husband continuously embarrass me like this?